Let me show you how to create this cool looking duotone effect in Photoshop. So here is our image on which we are going to work on. So first of all, I am going to separate this object from the background. To do so, I am going to select this quick selection tool and click on this select subject button. So here we go. This will make the selection of our subject. After making the selection, click on this select and mask to make more precise selection. By clicking on this refine your brush tool, I am going to paint on the edges so that it can make precise selection of layers too. So this is going to make the precise selection of layer. After this, I'm going to click on OK. So now click on this mask button. So here we have our subject cut out from the background. Now let us create a new document. To do so, let's click on the file and simply click on this new or simply Ctrl plus N on your keyboard. So I'm going to select 2000 by 2000 pixels width by height, resolution 300. Click on create. So here we have our canvas. So first of all, let's bring this subject to this document. So to do so, I'm going to drag this layer and bring it up here. So here, let's scale it down. So here we go. Let me quickly add a background to it. Select the background layer and click on gradient. So let's choose a basic gradient and let's set the background color to something off white, sorry, off black. Here we are. Let's change the linear to radial and reverse it. Let's increase the scale to 200. Click OK. So selecting the, our subject layer, right click and duplicate the layer. So we have two layers of our subject. Select the topmost layer, right click the layer and go to blending option. Now in this blending option, make sure the red channel is checked and green and blue channel is unchecked. Click OK. Similarly on the below layer, right click, go to blending option and just do the opposite. Leave green and blue checked and red unchecked. So here we have. Now click on the top layer, go to edit, transformation and flip horizontally. So here we have. Now place the image accordingly. I'll select both, I'll make it little bit bigger. I'll drag it down. Now I will adjust both the subject by scaling and moving it to make it look right. So here we have. Now let's do a bit of more adjustment. Let's click on this mask with the brush tool selected and black as a foreground color. Let's paint on the area which we don't want. For example, this air. Repeat same thing for the top layer. Here we are. So here we get nice and cool looking duotone effect in Photoshop.